Hey, James, Evan, would you grab Sean and meet me in my office? What are you looking at, you greasy bastard? What, do you rub that steak and cheese all over yourself? Get back to work. Look at this. Who is this guy coming down here? He thinks he's going to take me out? Nope. Not happening. Oh, yeah. See this mountain right here? Guy's dead. Dead. Hey. Yeah. No. It, Hello? It, it, hey, guy. Hey, hey what's go, up? We got to go get Sean and go to Gronk's office. Why? What'd you do this time? What do you mean, what did I do? He told you, not me. He called all of us in his office. I didn't, I didn't hear anything. Oh, apparently. Come on. All right, all right. Okay. Thank you. <sighs> Ready? Yep. Mm. Sean! We need to go see Gronk. Where are you? Oh. Hello. Hello, Miss Angel. Hello, Mrs. Mouse. Hello, Sean! Hi. The star. Christmas star. Uh-huh. Perfect. Isn't it great, you guys? Looks just like Santa's workshop. Five days before Christmas. No, 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 no. Oh my god, we're gonna get, like, screamed at. We have to see Gronk in, like, five minutes. What did you guys do this time? I don't know. We just have to go see him. He's gonna yell at us for stupid stuff like this. You know what he's gonna do? He's gonna tell us about how great we've been doing and how much we've been helping out the business. Okay. Do you guys know how a business works? Okay, well let me explain it to you, all right? I need to make money. And how am I supposed to make money when Rain Man here is up in the loft building forts? You think this is funny? This is a goddamn joke? This isn't even the first time. I got tape upon tape of you morons not only wasting company time, but company inventory. You know what? I got 150 feet of bubble wrap, gone. A thousand thumbtacks, gone. Fifty pounds of packing peanuts, gone. And the list goes on and on. I'd like to kick your asses to the curb right now. But I can't fire you until I file the paperwork with corporate. Otherwise, you guys walk away with a severance. And I'll be a baboon's ass if I'm going to let you guys dick around all day at work and then still have the last laugh. No way. You know what? You guys are gone. Get out of here. Get out of here. No, come on, there's yeah. gotta be something we can do. Look, how much do we actually owe the company? Here's how much, genius. By my calculations, it looks like about 34 hundo. If you guys think you can raise that, I'm all for it. If you guys think you got enough cans lying around your house to pay me back, I'm for it. You guys might be a little bit more productive. You know what, but come Monday, if that check's not in my hand, you guys are gone. Get the fuck out. Get out! Get out of my office! Fucking douchebags. Yeah. Dude, do you understand how business works? Oh, that man is what's wrong with the business. Aw, oh, come on. I don't think he's that bad. Well, he is terrible! What are you talking about? What? Terrible. No, terrible no. human being. Besides, I mean, I crunched some numbers in my head and I don't think we owe that much money. It doesn't matter, okay? The paperwork says that we did it, so we did. Maybe. Maybe we could just sell our house. Sell our house? We rent our house. Oh. I mean, unless we sold stuff in our house, like a yard sale, but... Yeah, well, I'm not selling my Xbox. Mm. Oh my god, we can sell your sword. <laughs> no, we can't. I use that to cut my veggies. Guys, just give up with the whole selling thing. I don't think it's gonna work, okay? Come on, we have valuable stuff in this house. It's gonna work. James, seriously, how much money do you actually have? A few hundred bucks, maybe? A few hundred bucks? Yeah. Sean, what do you got? Huh? Oh. oh let me see. Got some of this. Oh. All right, listen. I have a plan. You guys will give me all the money there's an Air Fighter 4 tournament coming up on Sunday. Cash goes to the winner, this guy right here. 
We're not gonna put our jobs in the hands of some stupid video game tournament. James, you don't get it, all right? Like, I've done this a million times. I never lose. Doesn't lose. Oh, you don't lose? Doesn't lose. I'm sorry, I didn't know that. Hey, you go to those antique road shows all the time. Come on, you are like an old man. You gotta have something around this house. Yeah, I mean, you got that magic lamp, you know? Dude, I told you not to tell anybody about that. Now the feds are gonna be all up in my business. That, that's not a magical lamp. That's just a regular lamp. You put a light bulb in it. Have you ever seen Aladdin? No magical lamp is gonna... Do you understand what's happening? James, relax, all right? It's Friday. We got until Monday, right? Oh, we, we got till Monday? It's only Friday? No, no, we're gonna lose our jobs. We're done. Fired! And there's nothing we can do about it! No lamp, no regular stupid lighting fixture is gonna help us out! It might. Oh, it might? Yeah, it might. Rub it. Rubbin. Rub. I'm rubbin. It's a lamp. James. No, I'm rubbing it. No, I'm rubbing it. Relax. Look, happening. rubbing you it. I double there rubbing it. Oh it. my god, will you just shut me up! What? Great. What? We just oh lost my, power. I can't see. Oh man, I can't see it. I, I just lost just my game. For the first the time in my life, I lost. Whoa. You who have released me from my prison, I am the great Sebastian of Baharan Zikari, son of Boom of the Head, father of Ristor Skidamosk, savior of. Well, you get the point. You have. Three wishes. What can I uh, do for you guys? What the hell? What is this? Well, I'm Sebastian, your genie. Didn't somebody rub the lamp? I knew it! I knew genies were real. No one ever believed me. Not even my cousin Tony. And he believes everything. Oh man, I wish he was here to see this. <laughs> no, I wish he was gone! That's two wishes, guys. You have one more. What are we waiting for? I wish for a million dollars. I can't give you that wish. You see, there's a big misconception with genies. We're not all big blue comedians, nor are we giant NBA basketball stars, obviously. But you still do have one wish. Well, what good are you? This is ridiculous. Well, I'm a genie. That, that should be good enough. No, 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 wait. Wait, no, I got it. What if I wish that Gronk took all the money? Oh, now see, see that I can do for you. All right. <laughs> oh, <Yeah>. yes. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> all right. Telling tall tales. Magic of the youth. Reverse this lie and make it a truth. And? Give, give me a minute. What? I actually can't give you that wish. Why? Because, you see, I can't grant something that is true. A apparently, this Gronk character you speak of did steal the merchandise. He what? Well, the good news is you guys still have a wish. No. No, that, that, that makes sense. See, every Friday, Gronk comes up to the, to, the, to the warehouse, and he always takes the old computers. And he told me they were going to charity. But that didn't make sense to me, because I was thinking, wait a minute, poor people, they can't even afford, they can't even afford dial-up. Holy shit, I knew it! I knew it! Uh, um, guys, I, I can't leave until I make your third wish, so... Good! What? You're coming with us! What? Come on, we, you can't no. wear that, though. Terrible. What is wrong with what I'm wearing? Oh. Yeah, yeah, I'm telling you, it's the same freaking three morons. Yeah, yeah, the tall guy with the sideshow bob hair, and yeah, the kid who smells like cheese, and that other one I call Rain Man. Yeah, man, all they do is screw around all day. Yeah, I can tell you though, I called them in my office. You should have seen the look on their face. I said, get the fuck out of here, man. <laughs> it's hilarious. Oh, guess what? <laughs> guess what? Oh, yeah. Yeah, they're here right now. Yeah, yeah, no, I'm eating it right now, man. Yeah, talk to you later. Bye. Well, look at what we got here. We got... 
the scarecrow, the thin man, the cowardly lion, and I thought they were all dead, but you seem to have dug up one of the munchkins. <laughs> oh boy. Hey, what can I do for you boys? Hmm. Quick question. I'm just wondering. How long have you been profiting off of stealing company property? <laughs> what the hell are you talking about? Yeah, we were looking at the numbers and uh, we see that there are a lot of purchases made for gold chains. So uh, we were just wondering where that money came from, Gronk. I don't know what you guys are trying to pull, but it's not going to fly. It, who is this little guy and what's with his shoes? Uh, who's this guy? This guy is Sebastian. He's from corporate, and I think you're going to like what he has to say to you. Gronk, right? Well, we've, we've been reviewing the paperwork, and it seems that these accusations do match. So here's what's going to happen. Either you replace the merchandise or pay for it. If not, you will be hearing from my lawyers. Basically, what I'm saying is... What's, what's the word I'm looking for? Fired. Fired. Yes, you, sir, are fired. We are letting you go. So basically I'm gonna give you an hour to pack up all your stuff into one little box and get out. This, is, this isn't over, you know, I, I'll, be, I'll be back. You know what? I'm taking my sandwich. All right. <laughs> yeah! Yes. Oh, <laughs> found it! Boom! Boom. Uh, do we have another wish? Yes, yes we do. Oh my god, dude, I can't believe it either. Hey, boss! No, his, his office still smells like cheesesteak. Huh? What? <laughs> they are slackers, tallywhackers, don't know what they're doing with their lives. They're really ugly, they suck at their job, and they certainly never have a wife. Okay, bye-bye.